Hello everyone, welcome to Mark Bank. In this video, we are going to solve a different kind of problem that is called alpha numeric series. In alpha numeric series, you will be having balls like like balls are used over here. This is A and then E, then then we have got I, so forth and so on. So you will be having balls and then you will be having consonants and combinations of numbers and special symbols so over here this is the special symbol and percent is the special symbol at the rate and this sign asterisk all of them are special symbols right so alpha numeric series will be a combination of letters including vowels and consonants numbers and some special symbols now you will be asked certain questions based out of it this side is is taken as left and this side is taken at taken as right now then we can do the analysis now this See the question number one, it says that which of the following is the 12th to the left of the 20th from the left. So the first keyword is we need to find out which letter is 20th from the left corner. This is the left corner. So let us find out which is the 20th. So this is first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th, 19th and 20th. So T is the 20th term from the left. Now we need to find out what is the 12th to the left of this number. So we have got this to be T. Left side of T will be this. And right side of T will be do this now we need to find out 12th letter or symbol from this t so let us go ahead this is 9 is first second third fourth fifth sixth seventh eighth ninth tenth eleventh and twelfth so m percent or a mark of percentage is what we have got so what is the answer answer is percent mark or symbol what what could we have done in this problem is rather than going the 20th position from the left corner and then coming back 12th position can we just subtract it 20th position negative 12th position what are we looking for we are looking for 8th position we are looking for 8th position from the left corner now let us try to find out what is the 8th position is b is the first first and second and third and fourth fifth sixth seventh and eighth now percent symbol is at the eighth position from the left corner what did we do we needed to go 20th position from the left corner and we were required to come back 12 positions so rather than doing this i would simply be subtracting 12 out of 20 and i would find the, i would be able to find out eighth position from the left corner that is what is going to be my answer so you understand what is left corner and the right corner let us solve one more problem Now the problem says that study the following arrangement carefully and answer the questions given below or say in this case is question because this is going to be the series of questions with the same with the same pattern or with the same alphanumeric series. The problem is how many such numbers are there in the above arrangement each of which is immediately preceded by a consonant 
and followed by a symbol. So I, we have got something. This position is called preceded by preceded by and this position will certainly be followed by. That is one logic that we need to understand. So over here say I have taken 7 and and the mark of dollar and y. So 7 is preceded by this symbol and y is followed by this symbol. That is what we need to understand. Now, how many such numbers? So we are going to focus only on numbers. So number is 5 and then 8. It says that it has to be preceded by a consonant. So 5 is being preceded by R, that is a consonant, but it is being followed by 8, that is a number. So it says that it has to be followed by a symbol. So 5 cannot be the answer. How about 8? 8 is not being preceded by a consonant. So 8 also should be eliminated. Now we have got 4. 4 is preceded by F, that is a consonant but is also followed by j that is a consonant so 4 should also not be the option how about 1 see 1 is preceded by j and followed by u that is not the case and we have got the next number is 2 2 is being preceded by h but followed by a symbol not a consonant 9 cannot be the option because 9 is being preceded by this symbol and we want something that is consonant so 9 can also not be the answer how about writing 6 6 is preceded by i that is not a consonant that is a wall now we have got 3 3 is being preceded by W and P, both of them are consonant, so 3 should also not be the answer. Right? And we have got we have got 7. 7 is being preceded by K, that is a consonant, and followed by a symbol. Can you see this? K7 and this. 7 is a number that is being preceded by a consonant K and being followed by a symbol dollar. So that is our answer. So how many such numbers are there? Only 7 is, is fulfilling the criteria. Hence, there is only one such number that follows the criteria. And that has to be the answer. I hope you are getting the logic. So, in the first slide, we learned the left corner and the right corner. In this slide, we learned how to write what is being preceded by and followed by something. We will discuss the same problem in the next video. Then we will take some more cases and solve some more series problems. Till then, bye bye and take care.